what's up guys thanks for once again for tuning in so i got a pretty cool uh video for you guys today i don't know if you guys can see in the background it's mizuno uh one of the guys uh, i met at street superior in singapore actually asked me to come up and meet up with him at his uh at their like head office i'm pretty sure and uh, he said it was next to tokyo station so i'm like all right let's let's go have a look <laughs> and um he just wanted to meet up and uh I was really actually interested in the, the Mizuno brand. Um, he kind of introduced to me while I was in Singapore. He's a kind of, uh, he, he kind of just showed how they kind of try to break into the whole sneaker sports lifestyle market. Well, they probably already have, but they kind of try to break into it more. And uh, that's why I'm just outside. So I kind of just did a little bit of my research, checking up on the Mizuno brand. Cause I do like to kind of, uh, you know, and explore different brands are just onto the hype stuff and um, it's gonna be pretty cool hopefully uh, I can get to meet some people in the Mizuno brand he actually said that he was gonna introduce me to one of his colleagues who was a designer for Mizuno so that's gonna be pretty cool um, okay my bad he told me to go to the office but oh my gosh it's so hard to put these uh, addresses into Google Maps and uh, I thought I'd go with the nearest uh, Mizuno I think they like the actual office is just around the corner Masato, the guy that I'm speaking to, is actually just coming to pick me up. Uh, I think it's better that way so I don't get lost. <laughs> Yo, what is up fam? So I just wanted to do a little bit of a break in the video at this moment because I, there were things I did want to include which I didn't get to video on the actual day. So what um, uh, Take and uh, Masato did as well on the day is a where we went through that store that you saw in the background and we went through multiple levels of just sportswear sneakers and all these crazy things that they um that they have there at their store so one of the main things that i really liked obviously was the sneakers which was on the first um level uh take was able to introduce the kind of sneaker that he designed uh which was unfortunately i didn't get to video because oh my gosh i just I honestly thought we were just gonna have a little browse and then I could take some b-roll but what we ended up doing was just we we went there um, he they took me through multiple levels of um, of their kind of uh, sportswear and the things that they sell and then we went back to the next location uh, so I just wanted to include that because yeah it was so cool like guys did you know that they sell suits that you can use for sportswear as well because I, I remember when I went there I watched a video of this guy playing basketball in a suit and I'm like how can you play basketball in a suit but yeah it's got really stretchy materials because in Japan if you guys don't know a lot of these guys they walk around they take public transport everywhere so movement is a really big thing there especially in their suits so anyway guys I just want to really want to include that in the video and so we'll continue from there Uh, so what's up guys, so I'm actually with the actual team um, from Mizuno, so let's take it here, there's Masato, I actually met Masato in uh, Singapore and uh, you know it was a lot of fun, so they be showing me, they actually took me to lunch as well, so I had a, such a really good time, very yummy, oh, I had chicken curry, and we ate on the university, which was university? Yeah, Meiji University, Meiji University, beautiful view, beautiful food, and uh, yeah, so the, um, they're just ch showing me all these different sneakers. What, uh, what's that one? I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, this is Wave Rider one. <laughs> Wave Rider. Our main, main, spot, our main sneaker. Yeah. yeah. So please remember yeah. uh, our project. Yeah. <laughs> so have a enjoy sneaker life. Yo! <laughs> I'm Take. Uh, work for Mizuno. Uh, I'm with Design Tree. Not today. So my favorite uh, actually is uh, Mount Control. Mount Control is a uh, archive shoes. Uh, uh, this is uh, uh, for running shoes. Uh, so uh, please uh, try it uh, wearing uh, with no small style shoes. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're talking about some of these sneakers. So this is one of the I think this is the OG ones that they had, the Wave Rider that they had. This is a really cool one too, a really popular one because it's a collaboration with High Snobiety, as you can see over here. Definitely another really cool sneaker. They have really big hints of the the big the Flybird. Was it was it Flybird? The Runbird. What is this one? Runbird. Runbird, yeah, that's right. That's actually the Runbird uh, silhouette design they have over here as well, which is really dominant in a lot of their designs, uh, which is really cool. 
as you can see. This is the Say Hello collaboration. They've actually collaborated with a lot of different kind of brands here. This is the M Mondo Control. And there was two different colors of this one. There's also the, the Beams, which is a, Jap is a Japanese brand? Yeah, it is in Harajuku, that's right. And so it's, it's so cool. And this is one of the really unique looking ones. This is actually inspired from a King Cobra snake. It was a collaboration with Pilates, Pilates, which is in from Barcelona. It's a shop in Barcelona, which has real snake skin. No, I'm joking. Which is so cool. And one of my favorites one is probably this one. This one. This is another OG colorway that they have. And if you guys can see, it's got that really irresistant. Um, how do I say this? Uh, run bird. I don't even know what it's called. It's like a really special changing color. It changes the color depending on how you look at it. And it's on this way side too. Mizuno. I really, like, really do appreciate hanging out with these guys because they'll actually be able to, um, how do I say this, uh, show me the samples that they have, which is, uh, I really want to be, say thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. I, I had a really good time here. I wish I could have uh, spent some more time with them, but unfortunately they have to go back to work. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> they have to go back to work, but uh, yeah. So thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. I just uh, left the Mizuno headquarters here, out in uh, Tokyo. Uh, the actual main one is in um, Osaka. And uh, that's just some of the crew that was so nice to me. Oh, they were so, they were, like they showed me the whole range. They showed me like the actual store that they have out in uh, Tokyo. They showed me like four levels of different stuff of like how they have sports style like for ping pong, uh, baseball. Baseball is really big. They do have Mizuna has a really big baseball influence out in Japan because Japan is such a big sport. Uh, sorry, softball. Baseball is, has a, a big influence here in Japan. And I just had a really good time. They were just telling me about all the collaborations and we just had a really good time together. So I'm going to go get going now. And uh, thanks once again for watching. If you do like the video, please give me that big thumbs up. And if you like the content, please consider subscribing to the video. All right, thanks guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.